Put a spell on you. I'm loving the Halloween music Me this too. morning. Welcome back. Time now for Bite Mare on Elm Street. <laughs> Getting you ready for Halloween with some seriously spooky treats. Joe Saltz is the director and editor, editorial director of Delish and House Beautiful and her family. They're showing us how to make simple and affordable Halloween treats. Welcome, guys. We're going to dive right in because I see you there. Hi. Hi, guys. How are you doing? Great. Good to see you. So the kids, I can see, are all dressed up as s'mores. I love the costumes. <laughs> yep. As they dig into some some sweets there. We got you're the gonna... s'mores going on. I love Say it. Hi. I yep. love it. You guys look great. I'm campfire if you didn't get it because <laughs> I got to play along here. You guys are having a party today. It so looks good. We we're are. excited to be here. So you're going to show us how to make some jack-o'-lantern bowls. Tell us how you're going to get the bowls into this the perfectly round shape for a party. This is super, super fun. So actually what we're starting with is balloons and we've washed these with a little bit of water and dish soap. And then we're gonna take them and dip them into melted white chocolate. So we have some white chocolate here. And what we'll do is put a little bit of orange food coloring into the white chocolate and melt it very, very slowly. It's really important to melt it slowly. Why is it important to melt the chocolate slowly? Well, honestly, white chocolate burns super easily, so oh. you only want to do it 15 second intervals at most, and then check it and make sure that it's getting nice and melted. So anything more than that, you're going to burn it. So you want to take your balloon. This is the best part, guys. Super satisfying. You're going to dip the balloon in the white chocolate and make sure it goes up the sides. And then look at that. You get this amazing bowl shape. And then you just take it with the white chocolate on it and then put it in the freezer. It just needs to harden for about an hour. And then it becomes this super, super fun bowl shape. Let me show you how cute this is. So we end up with this hardened white chocolate on the outside with the balloon still in the center. So then what we have here is we have melted chocolate in a piping bag. And then what we're going to do is just pipe the melted chocolate right onto the face and make this adorable little jack-o'-lantern face. And what I love about this is that all the kids get involved and they're having so much fun with it. But what I also love is taking some like eyeballs and sticking them right on. So we're like, you just have fun with this and do a lot of cool and interesting things. And wait until you see I, my favorite part, which Perfect. is when you have the hardened face, you put it isn't it so They're cute? They're so perfect. Um, and it just yes, takes 10 minutes you. after you've made the face, put the face on there 10 minutes to harden in minutes. the freezer. And then perfect the best part the is you pop the balloon. And I'm this is the part that my kids love. And the kids we love it. We love it. Unfortunately, we got to go, though. Happy Halloween to you guys. And you guys can get these recipes on goodmorningamerica.com. Well, hey there, GMA fans. Robin Roberts here. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Lots of great stuff here. So go on, click the subscribe button right over, right over here to get more of awesome videos and content from GMA every day, anytime. We thank you for watching, and we'll see you in the morning on GMA.